Imagine a spacecraft that doesn't rely on fuel tanks or roaring engines to propel itself across the cosmos. Instead, it rides on beams of light, gliding through space at unimaginable speeds. What if we could travel to Proxima b, the closest exoplanet to Earth, not in thousands of years, but within a single human lifetime? NASA has just unveiled a groundbreaking propulsion system that could make this dream a reality. But can it withstand the brutal conditions of space? And is this truly the key to interstellar travel? Let's dive into the science behind this revolutionary technology and explore the challenges that stand in its way. Imagine a spacecraft that doesn't rely on massive fuel tanks or chemical explosions to propel itself through the cosmos. Instead, it harnesses the power of light itself, riding on beams of photons to reach speeds previously thought impossible. This isn't science fiction. It's the future of space travel, and it's happening right now. NASA scientists have unveiled a revolutionary new engine that could take us to Proxima b, our closest exoplanet neighbor, in just a few decades. NASA has just unveiled a groundbreaking new propulsion system, and if it works as planned, it could take us to Proxima b faster than anyone ever imagined. Space travel has always been limited by the immense distances between stars, requiring thousands of years to reach even the closest exoplanets. But now, scientists believe they found a way to break free from these constraints. What if we could travel to Proxima b within a human lifetime? A newly developed propulsion system may finally make this dream a reality. But there are some serious challenges to overcome first. Can NASA's latest innovation truly withstand the extreme conditions of space? The answers could redefine the future of interstellar travel forever. The Limitations of Current Propulsion Technology Traditional space travel relies on chemical rockets, which have successfully launched humans and cargo beyond Earth's atmosphere for decades. When it comes to space exploration, Traditional propulsion methods like chemical rockets and ion drives have been the backbone of our journey into the cosmos. Chemical rockets, for example, work by burning fuel to create a high-pressure exhaust that propels the spacecraft forward. While this method has been effective for missions within our solar system, it has significant limitations. For one, chemical rockets require an enormous amount of fuel, which makes them heavy and inefficient for long-distance travel. Even the most powerful rockets would take thousands of years to reach Proxima b, the closest exoplanet to Earth. The biggest issue? Fuel. Rockets require enormous amounts of fuel to escape Earth's gravity, and carrying enough to sustain acceleration for an interstellar journey is practically impossible. However, these rockets are inefficient for long-distance space travel. Beyond chemical rockets, we have ion drives, NASA's Dawn spacecraft demonstrated the power of ion propulsion, using charged particles to generate continuous thrust over long periods. While much more efficient than chemical rockets, ion propulsion is still far too slow for interstellar missions. Even with years of acceleration, an ion-powered spacecraft would take tens of thousands of years to reach Proxima b. By electrically charging and expelling ions, these systems generate thrust, while consuming minimal fuel. NASA's Dawn spacecraft, for instance, used ion propulsion to explore the asteroid belt, demonstrating the technology's potential for deep space travel. However, ion drives have a major drawback. Their thrust is extremely weak. While they can accelerate continuously over long periods, they still fall far short of the speeds needed for interstellar missions within a human lifetime. Even with years of acceleration, an ion-driven spacecraft would take tens of thousands of years to reach Proxima b. So how do we solve this problem? Enter light sail technology, a propulsion method that doesn't require fuel at all. Enter light sails, the future of interstellar travel. Unlike rockets or ion drives, light sails don't need fuel. Instead, they harness the power of light itself to propel an ultra-thin sail to insane speeds. This concept, which has been theorized for decades, is now becoming a reality thanks to recent breakthroughs in material science and laser technology. 
Instead of carrying heavy fuel tanks, light sails are propelled by the force of photons. When light, either from the sun or directed lasers, hits an ultra-thin reflective sail, it transfers momentum to the spacecraft, pushing it forward. The advantage? Continuous acceleration without the need for fuel. At the core of this groundbreaking development is a sail thinner than a human hair, measuring just 50 nanometers. Crafted from silicon nitride, this ultralight membrane is designed to ride on beams of light, functioning similarly to a solar sail that harnesses the wind for propulsion. Using advanced electron beam lithography, researchers have created a trampoline-like structure suspended by nanoscale springs. This design allows the sail to withstand light pressure a critical test for practical interstellar propulsion. This method has the potential to revolutionize space travel. Theoretically, a light sail powered by an array of directed lasers could accelerate to speeds reaching 20% of the speed of light. That means reaching Proxima b could take just a few decades instead of millennia. But as promising as this technology is, scientists have encountered a major hurdle that could make or break its feasibility. The principle behind light sails is simple yet ingenious. Instead of carrying massive fuel tanks, a spacecraft equipped with a light sail is propelled by photons from a laser or sunlight. These photons exert radiation pressure on the sail, creating a small but continuous force that accelerates the spacecraft over time. This allows for continuous acceleration without refueling solving one of the biggest challenges of deep space travel. The potential speeds are mind-blowing. If perfected, light sails could reach up to 20% of the speed of light, reducing the travel time to Proxima b to just a few decades rather than millennia. This makes light sail propulsion the first viable technology for sending probes, or even future crewed missions, to another star system within a single human lifetime. At the heart of this new propulsion system is a sail thinner than a human hair. Researchers at Caltech have developed a prototype made of silicon nitride, measuring just 50 nanometers thick. This ultralight membrane has been engineered to withstand the intense radiation pressure exerted by light. Using advanced electron beam lithography, scientists created a trampoline-like structure supported by nanoscale springs. This allows the sail to remain stable while absorbing the immense force of directed laser beams. The key challenge? Ensuring that this delicate material can survive the harsh environment of space, where micrometeoroids, cosmic radiation, and extreme temperature fluctuations pose significant risks. For years, scientists have hypothesized that radiation pressure, the force exerted by photons, could serve as a means to accelerate spacecraft. Now for the first time, researchers have successfully tested and measured this effect at the nanoscale with unprecedented precision. To test the concept, researchers used a high-precision argon laser to push against the membrane, causing it to vibrate. To capture even the smallest movements, an interferometer was employed. This tool can detect vibrations as small as a picometer, allowing researchers to isolate the true photon force from any external noise, such as environmental disturbances. This achievement represents a massive leap forward in understanding how light can transfer momentum to materials as tiny as the membrane used in these light sails. The data gathered will help engineers refine sail designs for maximum efficiency and reveal how different factors such as temperature impact performance. By fine-tuning the material's response to light, the designs can be optimized for space missions. However, not everything has gone smoothly. When scientists tested the sail using off-axis laser light, simulating the real-world conditions it would face in space, a surprising issue arose. The sail's propulsion was weaker than predicted. The cause? Edge scattering. Instead of all the light contributing to the propulsion of the sail, some photons were scattered off the edges, reducing the efficiency of the overall system. This edge scattering could become a serious obstacle for long-term interstellar travel. To address this challenge, scientists are now experimenting with a variety of solutions. For example, they are testing tapered or coated edges that would help capture more light and prevent scattering. 
Another potential solution involves self-correcting nanostructures that would automatically adjust the angle of the sail to optimize light capture. If researchers can overcome this problem, the efficiency of these sails could be vastly improved, bringing the dream of interstellar travel closer to reality. NASA's new propulsion technology represents a paradigm shift in space travel. Unlike chemical rockets, which are too slow and fuel-dependent for interstellar missions, light sails could potentially reach speeds of 20% the speed of light, drastically reducing travel times between stars. This could mean shrink the journey from thousands of years to just a few decades, enable missions to explore nearby star systems such as Proxima Centauri, the closest known star system to Earth, make space exploration fuel-free by relying entirely on directed laser beams to propel the sail. The era of interstellar exploration is no longer just science fiction. It's becoming a reality. With advancements in light sail technology, we may soon witness the first mission to Proxima b, our closest neighboring exoplanet. This revolutionary engine, developed by NASA scientists, could change the way we explore the universe making the dream of reaching another star system within our lifetime a tangible goal. If you're as excited about the future of space travel as I am, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you can stay updated on the latest developments. The journey to the stars is just beginning, and you won't want to miss a single moment of it.